Hey bosses, it's Nina. So with IGTV and the new Instagram TV ratios that you have to use for your videos, you actually you have to use them vertically instead of horizontally. I thought I'd show you how to change these settings in both Camtasia and Filmora. Um, I'm actually using Screenomatic to record my screen, um, but um, I haven't found out how to change those ratios there yet. So I'll come back to that. Really what I'm talking about is on your desktop. When I want to record things on my desktop, I need to have the right dimensions so it's vertical. And so let's start with Camtasia. Before we get into the video, let me just tell you this short thing. This video is actually sponsored by App Academy. The link is below. App Academy is the number one coding school. And so I wanted to bring this to you guys because it's actually near to my heart. When I went to school for computer information systems, there were not a lot of people that looked like me. There weren't a lot of women and there were barely any black people in my school. There's a handful and we all knew each other. And so one thing I'm dedicated to doing is making sure more people from my community, whether it's females and women in tech or if it's minorities getting into um, development and coding. One, because there's a lot of money there, but we'll talk about that later. I'll give you more details. I just wanted to shout out App Academy for the great job that they're doing and placing these students in their six-figure jobs. So let's talk about that later and let's get into our video. You'll see that by default, I have the, the full screen selected. Now I can choose anything um, and as soon as I choose it, the aspect ratio is here or excuse me, the dimensions are there and you'll want to make sure it's unlocked because if it's locked, no matter what I put in, it's going to automatically change it. Okay. So before we actually change this, let me show you, I found this calculator.net and um, the ratios that you have to use for your desktop or for your recording for um, Instagram TV is either nine to 16 or four to five. So I'm gonna click on nine to 16 and you can type in whatever your first number is going to be. So if you know your screen is a certain size, you can you know type that in. I'm just gonna type in 720 um, for my first number. And if I click on calculate, it'll tell me that it's 720 by 1280, which is what I expected, right? So what I wanna do is in my Camtasia, which I now have to bring back over, okay? I'm gonna click on custom and I'll select anything and I'll type in, oops. And I'm sorry, it's gonna keep on popping around. It's done this because it's kind of finding the, it's gonna move out of the way of the screen that it's recording. So um, I'm gonna put in 720 for the first number and the second number is going to be 1280. Now, one thing to keep in mind, so you'll see this here, my screen isn't big enough. Um, I'm using my smaller screen and not my big flat screen, so I can't go up to 1280 here, so you may wanna go to a lower number. So instead of 12, um, 720, I'm gonna do something a little bit smaller. So I'm just gonna make up a random number. Let's just do 640. Now, usually what you'll want to do is type in one of the numbers of the pixels or whatever it is that you're trying to do. Um, but for now, I'm just gonna do this. So notice when I put in that number, it's like 1137.77. I can't put in points, so let's pick another number. Okay, I did the four to five ratio and I put 640, so 640 and 800. So I'm gonna type 640 here, it's gonna move. And then 800. And then that's the proper, um, that's another dimension that's accepted. So I know I can just put in that and I can use that to record for my screen. So I'll know that 640 by 800 is what I can use. So that's Camtasia, right? Now let's move over to Filmora. Okay. So let's take a quick break. You have no commercials because Act Academy has sponsored this video, but let me tell you why I partnered with them. One of the things I asked them is for concrete evidence of why people should sign up for their 12 week boot camp. So of course, everyone wants to make $100,000 and make their six figures and get placed at companies like Google and Uber and Yelp and 
all of that. So they gave me a lot of those stats, but I really wanted to know about people. So one of the stats that I didn't expect to get from is the fact that they helped over 120 people that were either unemployed or living in po poverty actually land $100,000 jobs. Imagine that going from not having anything to being able to support your family in ways that you couldn't imagine. So joining their App Academy can literally change people's lives. If you look at the fact that you can start their program and then pay for it once you're placed, and I'm telling you, go to their site because they're placing people in some major jobs. Like I said, Yelp and Uber and Google and Twitter and all of these people actually joining these companies that they had no clue that they could actually get there, right? In 12 weeks, three months, you can get there. So let's go back to our video, but I encourage you, go ahead and click the links to App Academy. If you ever talk to anyone there, let them know that Nina sent you, right? But um, let's... Okay, let's take a look at Filmora and how we change the dimensions here. I'm gonna click on full screen mode, or excuse me, full feature mode. And here, these features only work if you have the ability to actually record your screen. So keep that in mind. I know there's different levels and types of Filmora um, licenses. So anyway, I'm gonna go to File, go down to Record Media, and then click on Record PC Screen. Now, normally it's in full screen mode, which I always have, but I can change this down to Custom. And just like the other, um, just like in Camtasia, you wanna make sure your lock race ratio or lock aspect ratio is off because when it's on, it will automatically change it. You can have this at 500, or excuse me, what did we decide we were gonna do? I think it was like 600, now I forgot. Let me look at my ratio calculator, 640. 640 by 800. Okay, I'm gonna tab out of that. And let's see, can I not, just try to see if I can do that on this screen because it's not allowing me to put in that number. So this screen might be a little too small. Let me just move this over real quick. Oh, I can't move it to my other screen. Okay, I'm not sure what happened the first time, but I just put it back in and it worked fine. So 640 by 800, and here it is, I would be able to record this much of the screen, which still gives me a lot, um, but it gives me my ratio so I can record um, videos for my Instagram stories, but I can record my actual desktop movements, all right? And I said Instagram stories, I'm in IGTV. You can also use those for your stories. Um, eventually, they will have a button here where I can use it from my desktop. I have not gotten it yet, so I'm a little frustrated, but eventually I will be able to um, upload my, my um, IGTV. I'm confusing stories and IGTV and my images all in one, but um, I hope that helps. If you have any questions about using those features to record your desktop, go ahead and click below. Hello. Don't forget to head over to sociallynina.com slash App Academy so you can take a look at App Academy and their current special where they're running. They're giving away full scholarships to their boot camp. So take a look and let them know I sent you. Ciao.